The Chart of the Week is presented by Glassnode, the leading on-chain intelligence platform. In today's Chart of the Week, we explore the Spent Output Profit Ratio, or SOPA, a metric that tracks individual transaction profitability and one that can serve as a broader measure of market sentiment. So what is SOPA? At its core, SOPA gauges the profit or loss made on each transaction in relation to the price when the coins were last moved. So for those in traditional finance, think of this as a tool that captures the pulse of individual transactional behavior. And the value or the insight that it offers us is the profitability of each transaction that's being made. In contrast to other profitability metrics, such as profit and loss, SOPA treats every transaction with equal importance, regardless of the transaction's volume. So let's take a look at its values. When the value of SOPA is above one, it indicates that the majority of transactions are being made in profit. And conversely, values below one indicate there's more transactions being made at a loss. So these extended periods where the metric remains above one are suggesting that coins are being sold at a profit, hinting at a bullish sentiment. And on the flip side to this, the periods we see here below one indicate coins are being sold at a loss, signaling a market that's more bearish. What's also interesting about these movements, let's just take this uptrend here, is that the SOPA of 1 tends to act as a level of support, as you can see here. And throughout downtrends, we can see that it often also becomes a level of resistance. So the question is, what can this metric tell us in the market of today? Well, the current chart that we're looking at is the adjusted SOPA or a SOPA, which is just a variant of the metric, and it excludes coins younger than an hour. This refinement ensures that we're capturing genuine market behavior. We've also applied a 30 day moving average to this just to get a clearer picture of more sustained trends over short term fluctuations. So we can see that recently the ASOPA has dipped below one. So in other words, on average, right now, the market is currently realizing net losses. And this is quite a notable shift because it marks an end to this previously dominant, albeit quite modest period of profit. And while we did see a rally from the lowest point here, the trend has since reversed, ushering in a period dominated by losses. So what's the actionable insight here? For directional traders, the current read on the ASOPA metric calls for caution. The prevailing sentiment is bearish, and historically when the ASOPA remains consistently below one, it can be a sign of further downward pressure. Those considering entering or increasing their positions might want to wait for more bullish signals or use this period to strategize some entry points. For those already in positions, it might be a time to consider protective measures or reevaluate stop loss levels just to hedge against any further drops. I also want to highlight that SOPA can be a great signal for investors when coupled with other profitability metrics. Our analyst team have put together a dashboard that's also very much in line with the current state of the market as it offers a holistic view on market dynamics from the perspective of a recovery. So if you'd like to get a walkthrough of this dashboard and learn how custom charts like these can inform your current trading decisions, go to glassnode.com institutions and schedule a call with our team. We'll be here next week with more on-chain insights from Glassnode.